dude. About to kick this off. Friday about noon. Um, I'm headed over to Whitefish just finishing packing up. Got about a five hour drive ahead of us and then uh, we'll be rolling into Whitefish, sound check and play tonight and tomorrow night. Let's hit the road. Alrighty, we are off about 20 minutes behind schedule but we still have plenty of time. So I just Pulled off the freeway, I am in St. Regis, Montana. Little town that has a few gas stations and a hotel. And that's about it. Um, it's probably about the halfway point. to Whitefish. Uh, Loden is right there uh, through the alley. Band is staying up those stairs which is nice. We're, uh, we're staying right above the bar which makes it easy, easy on all of us. So gonna load in and then hopefully find a bed and crash for a bit. Drive, drive, drive through the rhythm and the tone. The music brings me closer but further is where I go. Sometimes a soul is better on its own until I know So tonight's gonna be a lot of fun. The, the crowd is always super fun here, always really good energy. Uh, the band always has a lot of fun. So go down, get sound checked, eat dinner, come back up here and chill with the guys for a sec, and then uh, show time. <laughs> Unless everyone's just looking at you funny, like, what the hell's going on? And then you're like, all right, waiting for this gig. It was way better. So everything leading up to that moment is all stress. And then as soon as I get on stage, it's all gone. What are you doing? I'm just a guy filming a guy. <laughs> yeah. Green room shenanigans. Whoa, what does the green room mean? Why do they call it the green room? Uh, oh, it's kind of green in there. Trivia from Chance. Is why it, is it, is why it, is it called the green room? I knew the question, but I don't know anymore. <laughs> you, you got me on the spot. I, right. That was a weed joke, by the way. <laughs> That's where I was trying to go with it. Really? <laughs> Alright, we got about eight minutes till we start. Uh, going on at 9.40. This is, the, this is the green room at the Great Northern. Matt One is in the books, gonna head upstairs and go to sleep. 
So if I'm being honest, tonight was not one of our best nights. We were definitely dragging as a band, I know. For my part, I was running on four hours of sleep, so definitely tired and it definitely uh, showed itself in my playing. But we still had fun, that's what matters. Uh, we'll be able to sleep in in the morning and then it's Saturday, uh, hit the ground running Saturday, got a new day, playing again tomorrow night, so not done yet. I just got done with breakfast. Uh, gonna head back to the room, maybe practice some guitar, and then go for a run. Gorgeous day here in Whitefish. Yes, I am wearing the same shirt as last night, uh, but I figured I'd be working out here in a bit, so I just used it as a burner shirt today. A free day in Whitefish is always kind of a treat. By the time I had woken up, the rest of the band had taken off, so I kind of had the, the day to myself to explore, uh, to, to work on some video editing, to get some guitar practice in. So, made the most of the day. Nick's watching some baseball. He went fly fishing today. I did. Caught a million fish. One million, all of them. Caught every single fish in Montana. <laughs> seeing but I needed a professional opinion. Alright, love you. Love you both. Don't don't put that in record because I don't know if that's true. <laughs> I could be making No, nope, it's stuff. spoken. It's a fact now. Do not. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. I gotta go repair. <laughs> Alright, night two. About to kick this off. Nick, you ready for night two? Let's do it. Are you? had a great time tonight. The band's energy was great. Nights like this are kind of why we all wanted to get into music in the first place. So, great way to wrap up the weekend. We're just finishing uh, loading up all our stuff and then we will be out of here. It's, uh, it's like 2 a.m. Gonna head upstairs and uh, call it a night. What are, you, what are you thinking tonight? It was super fun. I didn't get any crazy drunk people trying to come on stage. Someone tried to block me on stage. I had to Marshawn Lynch threw that shit, but I made it up there. Hmm, let's see, what else happened up there? Oh, someone switched out my drink on my mic stand. That was fun. I don't know what it was. It looked like chocolate milk. Uh, <laughs> but joke was on them because I have an N.A. beer, so she probably could have used it. Hmm. Other than that, freaking rock and roll, man. Hell yeah. So fun. All right.